Hello, and welcome again. This is ECG Workshop by ECG Kid Portal, and today we are going to spot difference between ECG features of SVT or supraventricular tachycardia and atrial fibrillation or AF. So, let's get started. Supraventricular tachycardia. Supra means above, ventricular refers to ventricles, tachy means rapid and cardia refers to heart. Together, SVT means a rapid heart rate above the ventricles. Supraventricular tachycardia is an ominous rhythm with rates often between 170 to 230 per minute. The telltale sign of supraventricular tachycardia is the narrow QRS which defines its supraventricular origin and its regular, rapid pattern. This rhythm is most likely not sinus tachycardia due to its very fast rate. For those who are at rest, narrow QRS tachycardias over 150 per minute are most often supraventricular tachycardias or SVT. During atrial fibrillation, the heart's upper chambers, the atria, beat chaotically and irregularly, out of sync with the lower chambers of the heart. Irregularly irregular rhythm, no P waves and there is absence of an isoelectric baseline on ECG. Atrial fibrillation is a chaotic rhythm with recognizable QRS complexes. The chaotic rhythm pattern and the absence of P waves are the hallmarks of this dysrhythmia. The chaotic baseline known as fibrillatory waves is quickly seen. Note that atrial kick is lost here and the risk of thrombus formation is particularly significant after 48 hours. Now let's differentiate between two. In SVT the rhythm is regular but rapid. Whereas, in atrial fibrillation rhythm is irregular and chaotic. In SVT, P waves are normally present and are covered by QRS complex due to rapid rhythm. In AF, P waves are absent. Note that in SVT, we see P wave inversion in lead 2, 3 and AVF in some cases. Atrial click is present in SVT, whereas absent in AF. The AF is characterized by presence of fibrillatory waves. Note, AF is type of supraventricular tachycardias and one of leading cause of morbidity and mortality in the world. So immediate diagnosis and distinguishing it from other kind of tachyarrhythmias is important.